So starting off, I'm taking this pink shade from one of the Kaja Bounty Bento palettes, and I'm blending that all over my lid. Now I'm taking my Colourpop and Beauty palette and using my purple shade and blend that all into the crease. And then to clean it up, I took a elf brush just to make it look a little more sharp and smooth. Now going in with the Unleashia palette on a color pop brush, I'm taking that pink shimmer and doing that on the outer half of my eyelid, doing the sort of half cut crease, and then I'm going in with the pink glitter. So here's a little comparison of how it looks with the shimmer and how it looks with the shimmer and the glitter shade. I say this every time that I use this palette, but if you don't have it, go get it. It's the best palette. Go get it right now. Next up for foundation, I'm going in with the next Bear With Me tint. And if you're wondering, yes, I forgot to apply concealer. So, no concealer, but I will be setting this with the W Air Fit Powder. Now I'm doing my lower lash line. I'm using all the same shades that I use on my eyes. The mattes, I blended those out into the outer corner and then the shimmer, I put that into the inner corner. Now for lashes, I'm using Yeji from Moulin Rose Cosmetics. Last but not least, lips. This is where I struggled. I don't know what shade I wanted. So first, I'm lining my lips with the Wet n Wild Brown Liner, and then I'm going in with a lip tint. The first one I use is the I Mimi Lip Tint, I think in Mystery Jubilee. But then that wasn't deep enough, so I went in with the Peri Peri Intense Serum in shade number five. I didn't like that. Really either it was too dark. And then finally, I went in with Oolong. This is the Oolong Boba Gloss from Moonlight Rose Cosmetics. So, yes, here's a little up close of the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more. If there's any videos you want us to do or products you want us to test out, then let us know. And bye, guys.